Savers, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing today? I hope you all have a good Thanksgiving. And if you did not celebrate Thanksgiving, did you have a good holiday and break? And yeah, if you are new here, if this is your first time coming across this channel, thank you so much for, for clicking on this video. I really appreciate you stopping and watching this video. If you love what you see, please consider subscribing and join this amazing family. And if you are returning, thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos. So, let's get right into this video. So now I'm going to unstuff my mini cash envelopes. See, look at all this money. I have all this money left over. And my change is right here. I'm going to be transferring this change into my coin count. I got to put my pennies back into this counter and let me show you what I have right now. Right now I have $9.75 so I'm going to put this in here real quick. Now we have $9.98. If, in case you are new here, this is my second time around filling this up. I already cashed some out. So this is going to be, I'm not going to mess with this until next year, until whenever it's full again. So, yeah. So let's see what, how we did in our leftovers. This was so good because, and all this cash came from me taking it out of my fall binder to pull back in my groceries. I'm going to take $25 out for my security bag. Then I will put the rest of this leftover up right now. So we can have space to do our cash stuff. In. My desk is small, but I like it. So now I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 90 dollars oh my goodness it's been a while since i had that much leftover money so i have 90 dollars did i say 90 i think i said 90. so my leftover envelope is right here so i'm going to put this 90 dollars in here and i don't know what i'm going to do with this leftover yet so now I'm going to restuff this mini envelopes. So I have my sticky note here and my daughter colored on it. I don't know. I don't know how she got a hold of it. So yeah, I have my breakdown here. And because my EBT card only has $100.34 left on it. And this week, well for the rest of the month, I think we have about five or six days left i need more than a hundred dollars on that card so i'm gonna get eighty dollars from my groceries this is my reserve variable expense binder so i, I took it eighty dollars here from there i'm gonna head to the hundred dollars that i have left on, on the card i hope i'm making sense here so so um my budget for this week for groceries will be one hundred and eighty dollars so yeah so next is gonna be gas gas is getting 20 gas I just like to top my tank up so I don't go all the way down that's why you always see me spending ten dollars ten dollars every week sometimes I don't even use it because I don't ever let it go down all the way down before I fill it up I just top it up with ten dollars and I don't drive very far. I drive 15 minutes to my work. So 15 minutes to go, 15 minutes back. So yeah. Spending gets 25. 25. Spending I uh, is also our takeout. So yeah. Like my kids love McDonald's. I just let them have it. And next is couponing. Couponing gets 20. twenty dollars and then last but not the least of my mini envelopes is miscellaneous 
and that one gets twenty dollars as well and that is that about my mini envelopes I'm gonna put them away so they don't disturb me but next we're gonna be doing our savings challenges and I'm starting with the investing one dollar a day investing challenge and um, I already went ahead to color everything because I stopped here last week and yeah I'm, I, I went ahead to color everything else in so I'm gonna be putting one two three four five six seven eight nine ten dollars in today to make thirty dollars for the month and my envelope is going to be somewhere here I believe my, yeah my DIY <laughs> label so I should have thirty dollars in here and I'm gonna be talking to mommy trader and then on how to start my investing journey next is gonna be my like challenge my YouTube like challenge I chose the video I chose as 93 likes so um, 93 likes times 15 cents gave me I believe something around 14 point something so I ran it up to $15 so $15 goes into my like challenge and what I'm gonna do with this like challenge is I'm gonna put it in my pantry stock up because I'm trying to get to a point where we can go to the farm and get some meat. So now in this pantry stock up, I have 50, 70, 90, 100, 110, 115, 116, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. I have $121 in here right now. My goal is to get to like around, I thought I said 150 but I think I need like 200 between 200 and 250 dollars in this envelope before I can go to the farm and we're getting there. So yeah, I already went ahead to call them in to save some time so I put 15 dollars in here today. Let me write it down. Last week I think I put 14 dollars. So yeah, 15 dollars goes in here. Yeah. Oh yeah, these challenges I forgot to tell you guys. I'm going to link every I'm going to link all these ladies in the description box in case you are interested. And um, the light challenge is from Crystal. This one is from Crystal as well. I will link her in the description box as well. Her channel name is Budget by the Bad. Next is my YouTube comments challenge. So that same video has I believe 50, 56 comments, which is including my response in, on the comments. So after I did my calculation, it came out to be $15 as well. It was $14, guys, but I decided to run it up to $15. So $15 is going to go into my YouTube comment challenge. But then I decided to put this one inside of my home, the credit card, because we are trying to pay this money off by February. So I'm trying my hard. We are attempting now because I took the money that was in here to the bank so I can transfer it to the card, onto the card. So I'm starting to fill this envelope back up. So this is going towards our deb, um, home depot debit credit card. So yeah that is that about my comment challenge i'm sorry if it seems like i'm rushing through this video but i just don't want it to be too long my last video was super long and i really apologize for that i don't like to do long videos i enjoy watching them but i don't know if i like to do them so yeah sorry if it seems like i'm rushing through this video i just want i don't want to prolong the video so next is my secure the bag challenge I'm so excited for this challenge because it's almost over and I can't wait to use this money. So I already colored this one in as well. My goal is $100 and the top, we are in the third week. And I'm going to be putting five bags away today. One, two, three, four, five. And each bag is $5. And this is the money that's going to be going to this challenge, which is $25. 
and I believe we're in the third week so I should have $75 in here if I'm not mistaken so we have 20 40 60 75 $75 goes into this challenge as of today and I'm going to link Gabby in the description box as well everybody that I use the challenges in this video I'm going to link them in the description box you can check their stores out they have amazing products in their shops and stores so and that is that by my security bag challenge next is my water challenge guys i've been trying so hard to drink more than three four bottles a day it's a struggle so i'm talking to you right now the time is 2 47 pm and i've only drunk one bottle of water today that is not good but i'm pushing myself to to get better at this so last week within seven days i drank i think i drank 20 no, I, I don't remember where I put the note, but I think it was 14 bottles. I, I can't find the people right now, but what I calculated was $10 that I'm going to put in here because I didn't, I don't think I drank as much as I did the week after, the week before, I mean. So, I can't find my note right now, but um, yeah, $10 is going into this challenge. So, the rest of this money... No, it can't be the rest of this one. Yeah. Because there's still one more thing I need to stuff. So $10 go into my water challenge. And this money goes into my personal binder, my allowance envelope. I'm going to be treating myself with this money. So, uh, yeah. And this goes in my personal binder. I'm going to be putting that in there later after the video. And um, the last but not the least that I'm going to be doing today is my kids' savings envelope. And because I've told myself every single time that I do a cash stuffing on this channel, every time that I do cash stuffings, I have to put something in their envelopes. So they are going to be getting five dollars each today. And I'm so excited because this was so started in this month and I'm already almost at hundred dollars in the envelopes so now I have 20 40 65 in my oldest envelope and then next the next child also gets five dollars so they should have the same 20 40 65 next my twin boy also get five dollars so 20 40 61 2 3 4 5 65 dollars and then the baby also gets five dollars this should be the rest of the money left in here so 20, 40, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 65 dollars. I'm so curious to see how much I'm going to have by the end of this year if I keep going this way. Even if it's a dollar, I'm going to make sure to put in there. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you sticking around with me. Um, let me know if you have any questions about any of these challenges in the description box or I mean in the comment section and please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you like if you enjoy it thank you so much and I would love to see you in my next video bye bye